Hello and welcome to our video on how to download and install Quick Launch in 2023. If you already have a license key and do not need to purchase one or get a trial license, please skip to the time on screen now. If not, please continue watching. To begin, go to ucworkspace.com and press try or buy in the header of the webpage. Doing so will launch our online shopping site. From our shopping page, choose the version of Quick Launch suitable for your meeting room. To learn more about the different versions of Quick Launch, pause the video now and see the version comparison in the description. After choosing your version, add it to cart, then check out. If required, add your credit card information and make the purchase. After the purchase is complete, your email which was provided during the buying process will receive an email with your license key and a download website. Launch the Kramer installer site from the email and download the latest version of the installer. After the installer is downloaded and launched, install Quick Launch digital signage, and secure browser from the list of applications. Quick Launch is the primary application, while digital signage and secure browser provide the ability to utilize more features within Quick Launch. After the installation of all three are complete, Quick Launch will load directly into the setup wizard. The first tab of the wizard is very important as it gives users the option to change the language of the software, as well as providing important links to FAQs regarding Quick Launch. The second tab is used to remind users to ensure all required software is installed prior to using Quick Launch. The following tab includes the end user license agreement, and we recommend that all users read the agreement before continuing to the next step. The registration tab is used to gather user information and to sign up to our email list. The license tab is where you will paste the license key that was emailed to you. After pasting the license in, the setup wizard will update with the version and maintenance information for this key. The Account tab is used to choose which room account type will be used as well as if Zoom will be used in this space. Choose your options and press Next. The Next tab will allow you to log into your room's account using a variety of calendar authentication types. This video focuses on Exchange, so see the videos linked in the description for use of Google Calendar in Quick Launch. We also have videos linked below for setting up Graph API in your space. The Zoom tab allows users to sign into their Zoom account using either the default Zoom sign-in page or with a vanity URL. If the Zoom page is not visible and you want to use Zoom in your Quick Launch space, ensure that Zoom is turned on under the Accounts tab. The System tab is used to choose if Quick Launch will start automatically and when the PC will reboot. Enabling the Quick Launch remote will grant access to controlling your meeting room from your personal device. The Reset Room tab determines what will happen to your meeting room when a reset room occurs. This can include closing apps, resetting audio settings, deleting files, and more. The display tab allows for choosing between flat and tab mode and also allows for the addition of a room name. Flat mode is generally used on large front of the room screens, while tabbed is used on tabletop screens. The final tab is where you choose to either start quick launch, start quick launch in lockdown mode, or continue configuring quick launch settings. After pressing finish, quick launch will load into your choice, and in my case, the interface loads. Thank you for watching our video on how to download and install quick launch. Keep an eye out for our video on Quick Launch settings coming very soon. For more information about Quick Launch, see our website at ucworkspace.com slash quicklaunch.